Hello, welcome to Red Ted Art. Today I'm going to show you how to make pom-poms using a fork. So, first thing you'll need is some wool. I've got some reasonably thick, nice, bright wool here. I shall cut off a little bit. I put the wool here and I'm going to hold it in place. There we go. And then I'm going to start wrapping. Like so. I usually go, is it about an inch apart? It's kind of a little bit of an experimenting thing. The more you do it, the more you find kind of a pom pom thickness and shape that works for you. Right. Maybe a tiny bit more on the edges. Okay, that should do. That's quite thick, yeah? So you can see. Now I'm going to cut it. And then I'm going to take the wool from behind, bring it over and round. So it's sort of... And then I'm going to tie a little knot. Can you see? Like that, and try and get it as tight as possible without ripping the wool, because I often rip the wool. If, like me, you do rip the wool, you could also use um, a baker's twine in the middle. Here we, go. Here we go. So baker's twine could look really nice. Anyway, so you've got it knotted like this. Pull it off your fork. That's your job done with the fork. And now you start cutting. You don't need pretty little scissors, but pretty little scissors always make things fun, don't they? Now I'm going to do the other side. Here we go. So now you can see it's a little bit of a funny shaped pom pom. Oopsie. Now off it goes. And all you need to do now. Just trim it. It's not a perfectly circular one, it's a bit more oblong, but that's not necessarily a problem. You basically just trim it into the shape you need. I often save the little bits that get trimmed and use it as stuffing on other projects. I'm a bit thrifty like that, can't help myself. So, waste not, want not. I have a little bag full of it. Let's see, what do you think? A little bit more here, a little bit more there, and that is actually quite a nice shaggy pom pom. Here we go, I think that will do. So put this to the side to save for another day, and there you have your very own DIY oopsie, pom poms using fork. Anyway, hope to see you here on Red Art again soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye!